Introduction to Python Programming Language Definition and Brief History Python is a general-purpose, interpreted high-level programming language, which was created in the Netherlands by Guido van Rossum at Centrum, Wixund, and Informatica, CWI. Python was designed to emphasize code readability and was conceived as an upgrade from the ABC language, which was inspired by the complex mathematical language of sets called SETL. What most people don't know is that Python was initially a hobby project for Guido van Rossum to keep himself from boredom during the Christmas season. One might think that the name Python has some significant hidden meaning or attribute related to snakes in one way or another. The truth is, when Guido van Rossum created the programming language, he was in a very sacrilegious mood, and being a big fan of the Monty Python's Flying Circus, Guido named his Christmas hobby after the comedy troupe from the 1970s. The Python programming language was also created to handle and interface with the Amoeba operating system. The language was implemented in 1989 and first released to the public the following year. Guido van Rossum was effortlessly able to see the flaws from the ABC programming language since he helped create it. He used most of the good features from the ABC language to create the Python programming language, which he modified to eventually remove all the flaws in the ABC language. After the creation and release of Python, its creator, Guido van Rossum, was recognized as the BDFL, Benevolent Dictator for Life of the Programming Language. After Van Rossum joined the Corporation for National Research Initiative, he received a mail from Ken Mannheimer requesting access to some BDFL privileges for a semi-formal team of developers who would oversee Python's development and workshops which would make Rossum first interim BDFL. Just like ice cream and chocolate cake, Python also began with only one flavor, but today, the programming language has gained a few more flavors. Some of these new types of Python programming languages are a combination with other programming languages. The various types of Python programming language include CPython, which is written in C and is the most common effectuation of Python, Jython, which is written in Java and is compiled to bytecode, IronPython, which is effectuated in C Sharp and is also an extensibility layer to frameworks written in .NET. Brython, which is browser Python, which runs in the browser. Ruby Python, which is a bridge between Python and Ruby interpreters. PyPy, which is an implementation in Python. MicroPython, which runs on a microcontroller. The Python Doctrine, the Zen of Python. A major contributing developer of Python who goes by the name Tim Peters, wrote a poem to list out the doctrine and philosophies of Python, which can be accessed by typing the code import this into the Python IDLE. The poem is known as The Zen of Python by Tim Peters, and it goes like this. Beautiful is better than ugly. Explicit is better than implicit. Simple is better than complex. Complex is better than complicated. Flat is better than nested. Sparse is better than dense. Readability counts. Special cases aren't special enough to break the rules. Although practicality beats purity, errors should never pass silently, unless explicitly silenced. In the face of ambiguity, refuse the temptation to guess. There should be one, and preferably only one, obvious way to do it. Although that way may not be obvious at first unless you're Dutch. Now is better than never, although never is often better than right now. If the implementation is hard to explain, it's a bad idea. If the implementation is easy to explain, it may be a good idea. Namespaces are one honking great idea. Let's do more of those. The Development Steps of Python The first version of the Python programming language was developed by Guido van Rossum at Alt.Sources in February 1991 and was named version 0.9.0. .0. This version was inclusive of exceptional handling functions at the core data types of list, dict, str, and others. January 1994 saw the release of Python code version 1.0 and had additional features such as functional programming tools Lambda, Map, Filter, and Reduce. Van Rossum had a significant distaste for the additional features in the Python code version 1.0. In October 2000, the Python code version 2.0 was released, 
This version came with the following additional features. List comprehensions, a full garbage collector, and the version supported Unicode. After an additional eight years of success, Python released its next major version of the Python programming language called version 3.0, also known as Python 3000 or Py3k. Unlike the previous versions of the programming code, Python 3000 was not an update, but entirely new code that removed the duplicate constructs and modules of the previous versions as an attempt to fulfilling the 13th law of the Zen of Python. Companies that use Python to provide products or services. Python is used all over the world by big companies to provide services and products. Companies and government organizations that use Python include NASA, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration used the Python code to create a workflow automation system, WAS, which proved to be cheap, fast, and effective. Google uses Python programming language for various system building tools, system administration tools, and various code evaluation tools. Google also uses the Python code for various Google APIs. Facebook uses a number of programming languages, of which the Python code accounts for 21% of Facebook infrastructure's code base. Since Facebook is a giant social media platform, Python provides Facebook with thousands of libraries and millions of code. Since Netflix allows their programmers and developers to choose their preferred programming language, Netflix's developers often turn to Python to handle their critical applications, such as the Central Alert Gateway. Among the largest companies to use Python, Instagram tops the list. The photo sharing social media platform was built on top of a web framework known as Django. Django is a web framework that is entirely written in Python code. Other companies that use Python code are Nokia, MIT, Discus, Hike, Amazon, Mozilla, Dropbox, Pinterest, IBM, Yahoo Maps, Walt Disney Feature Animation, Facebook, Expedia, Reddit, Quora, Spotify, Udemy, Shutterstock, Uber, and YouTube. Even though Python programming language inspired the development of many other programming languages, such as JavaScript and C++, it has a lot of distinctive features, such as the fact that Python doesn't use braces to remove code limitations, indentation is mandatory with Python, and attempting to import from the underscore future underscore package brings up a witty syntax error that says, not a chance. Python is considered to be a charming, elegant, and mysterious programming language, which is also among the top searches by Google users. Python has inspired other coding languages, such as Ruby, OCaml, CopyScript, Julia, Cobra, Groovy, Boo, ECMA Script, and Swift Go. We hope you have enjoyed this video on the history of Python and visit www.schoolroomhelp.com for more videos about Python and more.